Welcome to this learning session. Today we're diving into meta-learning, a powerful concept in machine learning that's often described as learning to learn. So, what exactly is meta-learning? In simple terms, meta-learning is a subfield of machine learning where algorithms are trained to quickly adapt to new tasks using only a small amount of data. Instead of learning just a single task, the model learns how to learn new tasks more efficiently. It's like teaching someone how to learn a language, rather than just teaching them English or Spanish. Traditional deep learning models usually require large amounts of data and time to learn, but in many real-world applications like robotics, healthcare, or personalized assistance, data is scarce. Meta-learning allows models to generalize from fewer examples, making them more practical and efficient. There are three broad categories of meta-learning approaches. Model-based methods use architectures that are inherently designed to adapt quickly. A famous example is memory-augmented neural networks like meta-networks or SNAIL. These models are often equipped with external memory components and learn to rapidly update their internal state for new tasks. In this approach, we adjust the learning algorithm itself. One of the most popular methods here is Model Agnostic Meta-Learning, or MAML. MAML trains a model so that it can adapt to new tasks with just a few gradient steps. It doesn't change the model architecture, just the initialization for fast learning. Metric-based methods focus on comparing inputs using learned distance metrics. Think of prototypical networks or Siamese networks. These models learn a similarity function so that new examples can be classified based on their proximity to known examples in an embedding space. Meta-learning is already making waves in various domains. Few-shot learning for image recognition, personalized medicine by quickly adapting to patient-specific data, autonomous agents that learn new tasks with minimal human input, and natural language processing for low-resource languages. Despite its promise, meta-learning faces several challenges. Designing tasks that represent real-world scenarios, ensuring generalization beyond training distributions, and managing the computational cost of meta-training are all significant hurdles. But research is actively ongoing and newer variants like Reptile, Leo, Latent Embedding Optimization, and Perl, probabilistic embeddings for actor-critic RL are pushing boundaries. The future of meta-learning is exciting. With increasing focus on multitask learning, lifelong learning, and AI alignment, meta-learning might become the foundation for building truly intelligent systems that learn like humans, adapting, evolving, and transferring knowledge. To recap, meta-learning is about learning how to learn. It enables models to adapt quickly with few examples. There are three major types, model-based, optimization-based, and metric-based. It's powering real-world AI systems, especially where data is scarce. If you're exploring advanced AI techniques, meta-learning is definitely a concept to dive deeper into. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more educational content on machine learning and AI.